Now to a 27 investigates follow up. The testing of the water in Mill Creek Park has expanded. The Mahoning County Board of Health is hoping to hone in on a particular problem spot. 27 First News reporter Greta Mitterator looked deeper into new results and tells us which area could be the issue. Uh, what we know right now is that in the, the headwaters, which is by the bridge, we've had elevated E. coli levels compared to the other um, samples that we've been taking. Mahoning County District Board of Health Environmental Director Ryan Tkak says the high levels of bacteria at Lake Newport's walking bridge is what led them to collect water samples from four additional spots throughout Mill Creek Park. And start pinpointing some areas. They did extra testing last Friday and then another test on Monday following this weekend's heavy rain. Here's an updated map that shows the new testing locations in red circles, which include the Wetland Bridge, Wetland Shore, near the walking path on Route 224, and near Calla Road. They were just areas throughout the watershed that we sort of chose because there's lakes and streams that actually feed to that point. The highest bacteria levels found on Friday were at the Wetland Bridge and Shore. They were three to six times higher than what's considered safe for kayakers, canoeists, and paddle boaters to be in the water. Now there's a possibility that there's an area that has uh, condensed housing that has old septic systems that haven't been looked at, could be failing. TCAC says nearby houses do use septic systems, but other problems can't be ruled out as more testing is needed to see if the results are consistent. The Board of Health will continue to take water samples for Mill Creek Park on a weekly basis through the end of October. Reporting for WKBN 27 First News, I'm Greta Mitterrater.